Again, these arc functions are all over the place. Uh, let's do this arc sine, or if that's going to be, let's see, 1 minus, uh, let's see, arc um, hyperbolic tangent. I'm sorry, not, it's, uh, I'm sorry, not arc, it's just hyperbolic tangent. Times, well, I gotta do the derivative of the um, arc tangent. I'm sorry, I, I keep saying that, of the um, hyperbolic tangent, which is the secant. Oh, you know what, I forgot to do something over here. This is squared, sorry about that. This is gonna be, um, hyperbolic secant squared. Oops, I feared that edge, don't I? Okay, I'm looking at it, and boy, this does look like the last problem, doesn't it? And what's this going to be? Well, let's write this over here. Kind of careful to do it. And then 1 minus the, um, the uh, hyperbolic tangent squared is going to be secant squared. So it's square root of that secant, hyperbolic secant, which is going to give me what? Hyperbolic secant. Let's see if that's in the key, and it is. It's letter B. We're good to go. Thank you.